It's just like he's singing it like an old sixties guy. It's weird. <clears throat> Olivia, I, I don't think we met, but are you sure that I should finalize details with you? Are the girls free to do what they want? Which girls? I don't know what you're fucking talking about. Last time, listen, I, I'm sick of the topic at 20 of uh, fucking 12 and 9. Last I heard, pig bitch wanted to marry me or some shit, and the other girl did too, and they wanted to uh, fuck around, yeah, with me exclusively pretty much, but I don't really care what they do, but... Um, I can't be making deals with you. Who the fuck are you, Olivia? Are you sure? Do you represent Big Bitch entirely, or is, are you Sue? I can't speak for the bitches. If the bitches have a have an arrangement with me, that's their arrangement. Let How about this? Me and the bitch will talk about it alone, without you, and we'll come back, and it will be mutually amicable for everyone probably but you. Um, we know who who matters and who doesn't. And I don't really give a fuck. I just want to make some new friends and, and meet up some old ones. Olivia, I can't promise you nothing. I never even met you at the last day. Stop trying desperately. When I talk to Pig Bitch, <laughs> I'll let you know. I think, given the information that I have already, I think it's something we need to talk about. And it's not really a big deal. And I think you're making it a big deal. She's got... And believe me, we will discuss it, but there's no fucking immediate hurry for, um, is there? What's the hurry? <laughs> there's no bums rush to drag my friends through any more misery that, that, that someone created in the first place. It, it hasn't been cool. We've all suffered greatly because of it. At least I know I have. No, I'm not going to say something like that because I don't own the bitch. If we did have some kind of marriage... What do you want me to do? Uh, move on a divorce and then and then get into an avalanche and they'll be like, who are you? She erased you. It's like, I'll just leave it the fuck alone. How's that? But, you know, I'm holding out that maybe I'm in no fucking hurry, really. It's none of your business, actually. I just, you know, I just need you to shut the fuck up about it. And then I can get back to maybe jerking off and thinking about her like a normal fucking dude and not trying to... Yeah, we're unnecessarily avoiding each other like the fucking plague, and it's ridiculous by now because we need to get over it. But, of course, we can't talk because everything's... But who cares? It's all right. As long as she's okay and alive and happy, I don't give a fuck. You know? I, she, I owe her one. You know? I did a rotten thing to her. She, she got me back. Whatever. We'll work it out. Don't worry about Olivia or stranger internet fucking person. <laughs> You'll find out eventually. But I don't think troublemaking is her gig or mine, really. You know, we like to have fun and, and, and get something out of life. Not make promises and talk forever. But I'm good at it, so whatever. Where are those titties, though, and the tongues out and the bitches? Never mind, pig, but she's, she's busy on the internet tonight with somebody else. <laughs> Leave her alone. And Mealabot, I'm not... Don't... That, that, that's not up for discussion anymore. But... But, I, you know, I like letting you know how it's going to be. <laughs> it's none of your business, you know? We created... I created cool characters and the cool shit now. And now it's going into the private phase. And, yeah. I know, I know that I excited you with my fucking skits. That, that That's interesting to me. But remember, that's not that bitch. You know, I, she... She's just a, probably an innocent, you know, nice little nerd like they say she is and shit. Awesome. But it's fun to do that. That's when you talk like that with a girl, you got to be in a totally intimate place with her. That's after you know her and shit, you know, it's just cute shit. But that's how she'd be talking eventually. Girls always do that for me. And I'll be busting nuts all the way to Hell's Gate. No, not pretty. If I have any say in it. She keeps thanking me and shit like that, so it just makes me keep wanting to fight the power for her. I don't think that's something she wants to do, and I don't think if I if I'm alive, I'll I'll help her try to avoid that someday. There's there's tons of pussy in this world, okay? <laughs> Being hell bent for her because some dude was, and getting nothing out of it for yourself is kind of insane, isn't it? I heard that, you know, we've all got our problems and shit, and we're kind of throwback people. We're not really cut out for this line of work. We're not perfect, you know? We know how, how you know, how perfect you are. And some of us would rather not be perfect. You know, we're not born blessed like Pig Bitch. 
and shit like that. Which is cool. But don't concentrate on me. Concentrate on the pig bitch, but don't tell me useless shit that I already know. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna, I did all that. You know, I did all that to, yeah, the universe and back. I don't care. <laughs> we all did. But, no, I'm not interested in, in bothering my old childhood friends that shaped my fucking manhood and who I am today. No thanks. Nope. I'd rather leave that alone because it's, it's precious and it's sacred to me. Want to get back with my fucking Valentines, with my fucking, uh, with my Bernard guy. You know what I'm saying? My, my peeps, my shits. Just for one day, maybe, or some shit. Because they made it to the end of this game And here we are Wow You know Now now we might look back and laugh someday You you might be right I almost threw up when you said that to me the other day But Yeah Just seeing those two motherfuckers makes me think We might laugh about this one day (laughs) Yeah but yeah, that makes me feel better. Just keep it positive, man. Don't don't demand answers from me. I don't, I don't even know you. I can't promise you anything. And she'll tell you I never promised you a rose garden. 